Hi there, it's Lily. I'm a first year medical student and former registered nurse. Today's video I'm going to discuss if I think that nursing school prepared me to go to medical school. I will share that my background is in cardiology nursing. So I spent five years in cardiology and three of those years I worked in the cardiac cath lab holding area, which basically means that I was checking in patients who were getting a stent placed. They may be getting a left or right heart cath um, or they might be getting a valve replacement. I was exposed to patients who had congestive heart failure, pulmonary hypertension, or coronary artery disease. And this background really helped strengthen my medical knowledge in terms of medical language and navigating the hospital system. There are several ways that I did feel that nursing helped prepare me for medical school. One of those ways is that I was able to recognize abnormal labs, especially for patients who were on certain medications. Like I knew that patients who were taking warfarin needed an INR check. I knew that patients taking furosemide needed to have a supplemental uh, potassium tablet. And I knew that we needed to check potassium on patients who were on those kinds of diuretics as well as diuretics like spironolactone. It wasn't until I started medical school that I learned the mechanism of action for furosemide. I knew that it was a diuretic and that we gave it to patients who had congestive heart failure, who were volume overloaded, and we needed to diurese them. I didn't know that it worked on the sodium potassium chloride channel in the thick ascending limb of the loop of Henle. And by blocking that, we are excreting all of these ions. And by excreting those ions, we then can become hypokalemic. And so we need to supplement those patients with potassium. My background in nursing allowed me to connect the dots of medications and lab values, but there was still lots of gaps that I needed to fill and medical school definitely filled those gaps for me. I often will go back to the metaphor that being a nurse allowed me to go from a to D, and medical school has filled in the B and C so that I can have a deeper understanding of how the disease process and the pathology works. Nursing prepared me most for the patient interaction aspect of medical school. In medical school, we have interactions with standardized patients as well as patients who are hospitalized. We learn how to take vitals, perform manual blood pressures, do IVs and lab draws. And fortunately for me, my background in nursing allowed me to be pretty comfortable with all of these things already. It wasn't this huge learning curve of how to navigate the hospital or interact with patients who have tons of IV pumps around them and tubes coming out of their body. That kind of stuff I was already comfortable with and didn't intimidate me. Because of my prior exposure, due to my work as a nurse, I felt like I could thrive in the clinical setting as a medical student. On the other hand, I don't know how much nursing prepared me for the didactics of medical school. And honestly, I don't know what could possibly prepare you for the didactics of medical school due to the sheer uh, volume of information that you're about to learn. It's truly not the content that is difficult, it is the amount that is given to you at a time. It is basically nonstop and the analogy of a fire hydrant is very accurate. You are given a ton of information all at once. You take an exam and it starts all over again. And you basically have to continue keeping up this momentum of being able to absorb all of this knowledge and take an exam and then maybe have the rest of that day off and it will keep going. Medical school is the first time that I have delved so deeply into histology and the pathology of disease. Of course, in nursing school, that's not something that you are responsible to learn. Being a nurse and being a physician is starkly different in this way. As a nurse, you don't need to come up with a diagnosis and a treatment plan for patients. That is the job of the physician. And honestly, that's why I went back to school to become a physician. I wanted to be able to manage complex care for patients and equip myself with the rigorous education that a medical school can offer me. The great thing about going to medical school with a previous experience in nursing is because you'll be able to pick up on the patterns that patients present with. You've been exposed to it before in the hospital you see that when a patient is tripoding, having increased dyspnea, 
and they're totally edematous in their lower extremities, you can recognize that that is possibly an acute decompensated heart failure situation. And that's because you've seen it in the hospital. And when we are going through these patient presentations, it's really exciting for me because I can tie it back to my work as a nurse and really visualize how these patients present in the hospital. Work in the hospital is often very collaborative. Physicians are calling pharmacists, nurses are talking to pharmacists, we're all trying to coordinate care for the patient. As a nurse, I had already learned how to communicate with the other healthcare professionals who work in this collaborative team. It was not as scary and intimidating as it might be if I had zero experience or exposure to the hospital setting and all of the people involved with a patient's care. I am super happy that my career prior to medical school was in nursing. I felt like it really prepared me for a lot of aspects of being a medical student and it gave me clinical experience, leadership experience, and allowed me to save money to start this very expensive journey. I do not regret becoming a nurse at all. If anything, that career choice helped me realize what my bigger dreams were. And in that job, I was able to gain clinical skills, leadership skills, and communication skills, which all helped me get into medical school. I really think that nurses make great medical students, and if that is something that you are considering, know that your background knowledge and experience is only going to help you thrive in medical school. I hope this insight gives you something to think about. Thank you for watching.